What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Back again with another video. My name is Brian G and welcome to a another haul video. And this is one legendary haul video. So let's check it out. Welcome back. Of course, uh, just like uh, the title of uh, this vlog said, one legendary haul. That means one pop. <laughs> but uh, but when it comes to legendary meaning, um, I actually uh, have uh, one pop to share before we unbox this one. Um, so uh, here it is. Uh, it's not going to be uh, legendary without a great haul, uh, without getting a great pop, right? But first up, I just wanted to actually share with you guys that finally, uh, I actually got the uh, Heady Spaghetti uh, Glitter Pop from uh, Funko Fanatic Philippines. It is limited to uh, 5,000 pieces. All right, so there it is. Uh, finally, it did arrive right here in Cebu. Uh, thank you so much uh, to our uh, friends over at Funko Fanatic Philippines for actually uh, sending this one over. And of course, I got it SRP. Uh, I was lucky enough to actually get a slot from uh, the raffle that they did uh, for you to actually win a slot uh, to be able to acquire Heady Spaghetti at uh, SRP. So here it is guys, my first pop is uh, none other than the Heady Spaghetti Funko Fanatic Philippines Limited Edition, limited to uh, 5,000 pieces for my first legendary haul. <laughs> All right, so uh, let's move on to uh, this baby. Uh, let's open uh, this uh, package. Of course, I uh, just want to cut through uh, the bag right away because I don't want to waste your time in uh, guessing what legendary haul I got. <laughs> all right. And uh, this one uh, came from uh, Bacolod, all the way from Bacolod. First time I actually bought pops outside of Metro Manila. Um, the, this guy uh, gave me a great price that I can't say no to. And of course, uh, um, he did a great job of uh, packing the pops as well. Although it just came uh, with the the J and T bag, but I don't mind as long as the pops are well protected. And I also requested for a stack for this one. All right, so let me see. All right, so here it is. Uh, the pops arrived in great condition. So uh, kudos to the seller for uh, packaging. Uh, the pops very well all right so uh, let me just uh, quickly cut the tape uh, from the uh, bubble wrap did I just scratch the freaking stack again I think I did <sighs> clumsy me but uh, let me slowly cut the tape from now because I definitely do have one sharp knife right here <laughs> I can't really even scratch the freaking stack again but okay, I'm just gonna tear through the bubble wrap right, just to avoid scratching the stack. Okay, okay, almost there. Can I get it out of the freaking? All right, one last cut. I need to do. I think that's it. Right there. Finally, have the pop. Okay, so here it is. Uh, my legendary haul is none other than. Uh, Mr. Uh, Bruce Lee. Uh, it is the uh, uh, gold edition, but uh, of course it is uh, the exclusive bait uh, with the exclusive bait sticker on it. All right. Um, uh, I think this is the uh, Enter the Dragon uh, bronze edition of Bruce Lee. All right. So um, this is also one of the pops that uh, reminds me of my dad. We used to rent like tapes back then just to watch Bruce Lee movies together and if you guys actually missed uh, the previous video wherein I got a special pop that uh, was uh, you know was a special memory of mine with my dad uh, when I got Astro Boy so you guys can click the link right up there uh, for you guys to check out but this is also another special haul uh, because uh, I'm actually on a mission on uh, getting pops um, that reminds me of my childhood. Uh, it reminds me of uh, my dad back then. 
uh, we used to watch lots of uh, Chinese movies like Jet Li's, uh, Jackie Chan's especially, and of course Bruce Lee as well. So uh, so happy to actually get the uh, bronze uh, Bruce Lee bait exclusive. But uh, like I said, this won't be a legendary haul without uh, the rest of the Bruce Lee pops, all right? So uh, let's uh, move on to uh, more Bruce Lee pops. Let me just, you know, hide a knife before I hurt myself, all right? And the next pop that I wanted to show you is uh, the other uh, bronze uh, version of Bruce Lee, this time with uh, his nunchucks right there. All right, uh, there you go, Bruce Lee with his nunchucks. That's uh, actually the second uh, gold pop. I think uh, he only had three gold pops for this line. But where's the uh, next one? I think, I think, did I take it out of my sh shelf or not? But I think they we do have one more. Okay, okay, sorry, I have it here. Um, uh, the next gold pop from Bruce Lee is uh, the Bruce Lee Flying Kick, right? I think it's the, the Flying Kick Bruce Lee Bronze Pop right here, uh, which completes the whole, the whole bronze uh, or gold uh, pops for Bruce Lee. And uh, moving on to the next four uh, pops, we uh, let's start off with, of course, the iconic yellow uh, outfit with of course the onitsuka shoes of bruce lee all right i forgot the movie of this one if i'm not mistaken it's maybe enter the dragon i'm not really sure correct me if i'm wrong but uh, this is it it's uh, the uh, bruce lee with nunchucks of course uh, everything has uh, the the uh, bait sticker on it so i'm so happy to actually finally acquire another a personal grail of mine and uh, moving on to the next one we do have the iconic uh, white pants of uh, Bruce Lee right here all right I think this entered the dragon uh, from the movie enter the dragon I don't know but um, uh, like I said I'm just on a mission of uh, hunting pops that uh, reminds me of the good old days with my dad so uh, here it is, guys. It's uh, the Bruce Lee with white pants. Of course, uh, we do have the uh, the uh, the scratches from the battle right there. Bruce Lee uh, on his face. Of course, the iconic pose. You know. <laughs> so uh, there you go. It's uh, the uh, Bruce Lee uh, with white pants. I'm just gonna line this one up for you, for you so that you guys can all see it. All right. And moving on to uh, the. Uh, Sixth pop is uh, none other than this time uh, Bruce Lee with uh, the black pants. All right, so uh, here it is. Uh, it's uh, Bruce Lee with the the black pants, <laughs> the iconic black pants. And uh, lastly is uh, none other than the iconic flying kick of Bruce Lee. This time uh, with this yellow uh, outfit right there. So uh, there it is. It is the Bruce Lee flying kick, so that officially um, uh, completes my uh, uh, Bruce Lee line. Although, uh, but I think uh, the the line has uh, custom uh, custom Bruce Lee uh, bloodied version of uh, some of the pops that, that I just showed you. Uh, hopefully, uh, I can get my hands on it. Um, if not, I don't really mind as long as I have all the Bruce Lee's here. Although they actually recently released a Bruce Lee San Francisco flying kick uh, version wherein Bruce Lee was wearing the uh, San Francisco uh, jersey, uh, baseball jersey. And uh, it has an orange version as well. Um, some of them were actually uh, given to the VIPs of that game uh, wherein uh, the uh, wife, I think... Of Bruce Lee or was it the daughter I'm not really sure but uh, one of uh, uh, the family members of Bruce Lee actually signed the orange flying kick San Francisco pop which was limited to a few pieces only and was given to the VIP uh, uh, to everyone in the VIP who actually watched that game but uh, will I have a chance to get it I'm I don't know 
uh, I'll definitely try but if it's way too expensive I probably would pass on it because uh, you know seeing Bruce Lee in a San Francisco jersey is not really that appealing to me but this is definitely uh, appealing to me which is uh, the uh, iconic uh, Bruce Lee uh, you know line so I probably might just go for uh, the bloodied version of uh, Bruce Lee pops but I don't know we'll see we'll see we'll uh, we'll definitely test my luck if I can get a hold of those custom bloodied Bruce Lee pops but anyway uh, that's it for the legendary episode <laughs> hope you guys liked the uh, legendary hauls that I did of course we got Bruce Lee and of course uh, uh, the flower among all the thorns is none other than the heady spaghetti um, glitter pop which was uh, which is actually limited to five thousand five thousand pieces all right so thank you once again to Funko Fanatic Philippines for this um, I definitely will keep this and uh, forever be part of my collection if uh, I don't know who knows if I might let go of my Jollibee collection but it's uh, definitely definitely a treat to finally win something <laughs> even though it's just a guaranteed slot for me to actually get uh, this pop at SRP but I don't mind you know it's uh, the first time to actually uh, want something in uh, my Funko Pop collecting life all right so uh, thank you once again Funko Fanatic Philippines for the heady sp spaghetti glitter pop so uh, hey there it is uh, my legendary episode for you hope you guys liked it um, uh, just really really like on a mission in hunting pops that uh, reminds me of the good old days with my dad so uh, thank you so much for joining me in this legendary episode and of course don't forget to click the like and subscribe button we're 200 strong hopefully we get to 300 as fast as possible with of course your help and uh, don't forget to click that notification bell as well to get notified in my future videos this has been Brian G with uh, this legendary episode saying my legendary goodbye ciao